Now we can utilize a tool like WhatWeb to recognize web technologies, not just by HTTP headers, but by analyzing web pages contents and determine what's running behind the scenes. So WhatWeb will identify and report on a variety of information such as web server types, email addresses embedded in web pages, script types used, Google Analytics and AdSense IDs, and many other details that can help build a profile against our target website. Now for the Metasploitable machine, instead of using the IP address, let's go ahead and modify the Etsy host file so that way we can have a domain name in place of the IP address, kind of make it look a little bit more believable. So gedit or nano, whatever tool, text editor of your choice, we'll go to Etsy host. And then in a new line, 10.0.2.18, that is the IP of my Metasploitable 2 machine. And then if you just hit tab, you'll see that you could type in Metasploitable or whatever host name, evil site, et cetera, whatever you want to put. So that way we can map Metasploitable to this IP address locally within our Kali machine. And then you can go ahead and save that. So if we go ahead and ping Metasploitable, we'll see that we're getting a 64 back from 10.0.2.18. Now we know that we set it up right and it's working. It's able to resolve Metasploit. It's able to now resolve Metasploitable to the IP and vice versa. Now for WhatWeb, WhatWeb is pretty simple. We'll just do WhatWeb and then we can type in HTTP colon slash slash Metasploitable. And then we'll get something back. We got a 200 OK. Apache version 22.8 country that's reserved. It's not going to show us that. HTTP server is going to be Ubuntu Linux, Apache. The IP PHP version title Metasploitable 2 Linux and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Now this command that we just ran is performing a pass to scan. So it's not really gonna get logged a whole lot on the target server. And if it does, it'll just look like regular traffic. It's not gonna stand out like a sore thumb, it's not gonna look malicious or anything like that. Now, if we wanted to do a more aggressive scan, we could specify other parameters. So we could do what web. We can quickly type what web dash dash help. And we see all these different options over here. And we can see on the aggression level. So the aggression level controls the trade off between speed, stealth and reliability. So one is for sell, one is for stealthy, three is for aggressive and then four is heavy. So the more aggressive you make the scan, the higher you'll kind of stand out, the more logs will be generated on the target server.